Hello. It's a Tuesday the 19th of April today. We're just going local things today. Going to go for a tour around the loch. Loch Rannoch. Look at this, John. Have you noticed my room? I have a lot of pillows here. Oh. There's a slight issue with my pillows. They supplied the type that I didn't like, all foamy and squishy, so I've tried out all different things. Ah, it's yeah. getting better each time. Yeah. There are some ornamental plates in my bedroom. Maybe the owner likes cats because there's one. And there's a little kitten. Look at that one. Yes. <laughs> Do you like that? Yes, Tina would like that. I think she would. <laughs> Yippee! Yes. Alright then, what's the time today? What's the time? Mr Wolf, half past twelve. Half past twelve, and we're yes. just setting out to go to Kinloch Rannoch. We're going to try and find something to eat in, yes. the, in the village. Yes. Hey John. Yes. What do you think about this then? Oh yeah. Beautiful place, isn't it? Loch Rannoch. We're supposed to be following the clan trail here, but we forgot until we'd passed the first point and the second point. It had vehicles in it for once, of course. Ah, there we go. I have to look another time. But yes, on around the lock they've got several clan trail notice boards, I think. Does it say what happened at each point or which clan yes. used to be there or something? Yes. And there's a barracks as well, so there's seven in all. And we've missed out two. Clan guide, there we go. So there's six clans and a barracks, is that right? Oh, uh, no, there's... There's eight. Oh, I didn't realise that. Oh, well, there uh, we go. Including the barracks, so mm -hmm. seven. Yeah. One more than I thought. Yes. Should we head on to the McDonald's place then? Yep. So it turns out we couldn't actually park at the McDonald's place after all, because there was nowhere to park. The one before that, the Mingus site, was full of cars. Well, well, there was only space for one car and that was full. And we missed the McGregors completely. But we're having a nice ride. It's a lovely day. The scenery is wonderful. This is the road we know so well. We've been along it quite a few times already. I think it's five before this that we've been along this one way and another. This is the village of Kinloch Rannoch. Beautiful little place, so quiet too. Looks like they're renovating this old building here. The plastic in the windows at the moment, cheating. On the bridge now. Yeah, it's quite a small village, but bigger than I think we expected before we came here. And there's the river, and on the far side of the bridge there are a few more buildings, but not too many. Right, the three of us are going to go and have a look in the cafe. You're looking very cool then, John. Yeah. Why don't you take your sunglasses off, eh? Come on. Look at that view outside the mountain. Perhaps we don't have to get out till uh, at 10 o'clock then. Perhaps no. We'll have a little bit of leeway. Long time empty. Yeah, it is. 30th of July. Yes. It's a nice place, isn't it? Yes. We can order some food. Our lunch has arrived. What have you got then, John? A chicken mayonnaise. Sandwiches? Yes. What have you got, Mum? I've got brie and bacon toasties, I think. Mm, I've got an omelette with cheese and ham. There we go, that's the Riverbank Cafe. Very nice little place. I think we're heading off on our little tour now around the other side of the loch. Sunglasses are at a nice jaunty angle okay. there, John. You see this is the old petrol station here, John. Yes. There's a very small one. Oh. That was nice, wasn't it? Nice. Oh, I thought it was very nice. Mm. You like yours, John? Yes, thank you. Yeah, good, wasn't it? Have you got enough bottles there, mate? Yes. Uh, how many have you got in the back with you? 
One, two, three, four. Four? That's yes. a heck. Oh dear. You had to go with the iPad and then does it still work here? Right, well, that works here. Oh yes. wow, that's good, isn't it? <laughs> Should have written the thing down oh, and yeah. sit here and yes. <laughs> recover after yesterday's hectic, oh. hectic. Oh. Mm. A nice lunch. Nice lunch. Yes, very nice. Nice to get some gluten-free stuff as well. Just been in the shop, but unfortunately we forgot the call back, so we're going to have to go home before continuing our tour. That's good, isn't it? <laughs> Oh. Noodle Mark Three oh, today. We've all been noodles, haven't we, on this holiday? <laughs> oh God! Oh. Yeah, forgot to bring the cool bag. Oh dear. So we got to go back to the house, and we'll go round the the loch the other way. Oh, that man's Icarus. Look, James, we were oh. talking about Icarus yesterday. Yes, from a... Oh, it's a nice old place, isn't it? This village. Kinlock Brown. Thank you, sir. village according to the signage but there's still some houses here they're not officially included in the village no, they're, they're self-catering and hotel oh. things so they don't count uh. and they're ugly oh well these ones you're not a big fan of these ones around no. here are really. you no. <laughs> yeah it's a bit of an unusual choice isn't it This bit around the corner, it's good, isn't it? I can hear the jet fighter here. Yeah. I thought it was me then. <laughs> <laughs> Cornering. Yeah, you were going really fast then. Yeah, it must have been going all of 25. Yes. And from now on, it's just the odd cottage here and there, and a lot of beautiful loch side scenery. entrances to a few grand houses here and there are a few lovely looking cottages along the route but you wouldn't want to live here mum no. no I'm not sure I would like to live here because anytime you went out you're limited to going one direction yes. for miles and miles and miles and yes. bit. but uh, I can think of a lot worse places to live to let's just oh, say that slough <laughs> don't diss slough <laughs> Is it 10 miles along this road? Yes. Wow. You could have southern fried chicken if you like tonight as well, Jake. Me? Yeah. Oh, I could do, yeah. yeah. I like southern fried chicken. Is that what you're having, John, tonight? Yes. Yeah. What do you think of this route? Oh, spectacular. It's a lovely one, isn't it? Yes. You're not getting fed up with it no. yet. Is it this? This is the seventh time we've done this since we came. Uh, must be. Topiary lion up there. <laughs> what about that, eh? Hey? Is 
a little island out there and it's got a little fortification and, and I think Mum said it was a jail. It looks like a teeny weeny turret of a castle but... Yes. We've seen them having their meal every time, I think, that we've been past. <laughs> First time, and now we saw them today. Did we see them yesterday eating? I think we did, didn't we? Yes. Yeah. And Sunday. And Sunday. Sunday lunch. <laughs> We're just going out, weren't we? We'll be sitting down every Sunday lunch. Almost home now, just down here, past, what's it called, the lodge or something. I don't know what this one is, that might be a lodge, might mm -hmm. it? I think it is, yeah, yeah. Gates, Gates Lodge. lodge. And then Bridge of Gower Guest House is just in the trees here. So, that's the guest house, and then there's our bit. Guest house is like a hotel, John. Yes. So you can, you know, have... Like a B&B &B almost, yeah. yeah. Except often you have, you can have an evening meal as well. Yeah. Number one, that's us. Found out that John actually had an extra bottle in the car after all. <laughs> about that? He smuggled five bottles at the start. <laughs> yeah. So just having a short break at home, drop the stuff off, then we're heading out again. It was a very nice cafe. I'm hoping to go back there again on Friday. Oh yeah, that would be nice, wouldn't it? That will be. Yeah. Did you want to go to Killin again on yes. Friday? Yeah, that looked lovely with the waterfalls, didn't it? We saw yesterday. Yeah. It was. Yeah, it was a great drive there as well, wasn't it? It was beautiful. Mm. Past Shihalian, is it called? Yeah, and then Loch Tay. Yes. Beautiful. Yeah, I look forward to doing that. We've got a big drive across the Cairngorms one day. Ooh, tomorrow. Oh, tomorrow. Wow. Yes. What are you eating now, John? Half pot pie. Oh, yeah, as if you need anything after that. <laughs> Oh, we've actually stopped at one at last. Can you believe it? How do yeah. you pronounce that then, James? How do I pronounce what? The McDougal clan war cry. Buad no bass. Victory or death. It was above here on the hillside beyond the trees that the skirmish of the Red Cory occurred between Duncan Reemhar, a local hero, and McDougal of Lorne and their respected men. The MacDougals were defeated and their chief captured and imprisoned on the island fortress of Eileen Nan Brutalian. The Cranach with the jail on it. This is the far side of the loch to the way we usually go. We're on the south side. And that's the hydroelectric power station you can see up there. They're doing some work on it at the moment. We've been searching for the Clan Cameron graveyard, but we can't find it. This is Blackwood, though. You like this bit, John? Yeah, cool. Yeah, it's a really dense bit of wood. We've been following alongside it on this road for quite some time. Well, I don't know where this Cameron place no, is. I don't. 
Ah, oh, this is a great trail, isn't it? <laughs> We've been following. That's a nice drive, anyway. Jelly baby time. You like this bit, John? Yes, do. Kari, Kari, I don't yes. know how you pronounce it, yeah. The dog likes it too, don't yes. it? Can you hear it barking? <laughs> What a beautiful place. You enjoying the ride then, John? Yes. It's good, isn't it? A belting yes, it day out. It's just a short ride compared to yesterday. Oh my God, yes. So this is at the Robert's, Robertson yes. site. Yes. Except we can't see a board or anything no. for this one. Mm. <laughs> God, they've really done this well, haven't they? Most of the signposts aren't there. The ones that there have been, we haven't been able to stop. <laughs> ah, found the board for the Robertsons, hidden amongst the trees. Here's Mum coming to have a look at it. Yeah, a bit chilly in the breeze, but it's quite warm in the sun today, though. Yeah. Hot like a greenhouse. Yeah. Yes, I'm sure this is well worth the trek, Mum, to come and read this board here. <laughs> Found the Stewart clan trail marker. Wow, Yay. at the eastern end of the loch. And look at this view from here, isn't that something? The clan Stewart memorial. Oh, it's not that cold. Come yeah, on, it's a bit fresh. Oh, yeah. How about this then? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, John, don't be silly. There are those hotel buildings over there that we saw when we were driving past earlier today. So, we've come back all the way along the south side of the loch because Mum was so desperate to see the Cameron's one. And guess what? We can't find it. So they've let us down again, bloody Camerons. <laughs> and although we didn't find the site of the Camerons Memorial or whatever it is, we have got a beautiful little cove here. Look at that. What a picture. We're now very close to the Bridge of Gower again, and this is the church. John and I are just going to have a look, maybe Mum too. Church is open because John's just slid in there. This is a pleasant little church, isn't it? Yes, it is. Mm. This is a funny little area here, isn't it? It is. It's got the stone steps up. I think these stones were reused from an older church or something. It said, I hope this was the right steps that I'm looking at. It's unusual to have a chair next to the altar. There's an engraved glass. It's weird the way they've done a top name there, Murray with a tiny weeny A and Cobbold with a tiny weeny D on the end. There's just one little cottage next to the church. 
otherwise it stands quite away from the other buildings. And you've just been sitting in the car here. Mm, admiring the scenery. Wow, it's quite something, isn't it, really? Yes. Look at this. Are we going down to the station now, then? Yes, please. Yes. Wow. This is Rannoch Station. Not much here apart from the station buildings themselves and a strange dilapidated cottage there. And there's a very strange looking vehicle here that looks like it could go on the road, obviously, but also on the train tracks. It's got pneumatic tyres and also metal wheels for the rails. Have you ever seen anywhere like this before, John? No. Bit weird, isn't it? Yeah. Five miles from our house and it's the end of the road. We're on our way back now, this is the five mile road between the station and our house. You can see Shehalian on the far left, a little pointy bit. The River Gower. the view from my bedroom window. You can just about see the church where we were an hour or so ago, past next door's roof. Oh, knackered now. <laughs> Is that a cosy chair then? It's not bad actually, because it reclines as well. Oh, so. oh yeah. And then you have fun getting out of it, don't it's you? It's a bit of a bugger to get out <laughs> of it. And if you were ancient, a lot more ancient than me, I'm sure you'd have a struggle. I shall demonstrate now. Oh. Right. Sitting up, I have to push with your legs down. I have to push hard. And then you go like that, nothing happens, because it comes up <laughs> again. Oh. Yeah. We have this performance every time you get up. So. No? No. Try and come up a bit further. Oh, God. <laughs> no. Oh, dear. Just come back a bit further. Come on. Oh, dear. <laughs> this is almost the worst it's been. Come on. Hey. Yay! Hmm. I think there have been one or two occasions where it's been worse than that. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, puffed out now. That's your exercise for today. Yeah, it is. Machine washing, washing, washing. Uh, it's supposed to be an easy day today. I think you were as tired as you were <laughs> after. Yes. The big one yesterday. Oh, yes. I must get to bed mm. earlier tonight. It's half dark past 11 last night and I want to do an early night. Are you going to be ready to do a big drive tomorrow? Well, I hope so. If I can get to bed earlier. <laughs> <laughs> it's more an ordeal than a holiday, isn't yeah. it? <laughs> On Sunday night, I watched Big. Last night, I watched Kevin Stacey Christmas special. And tonight, I'm going to watch Con Air. Wow. It's quite late for you to be watching a DVD. Mum's off to bed in a few minutes, is that right? Yeah, I'm knackered. Oh, dear. Well, it was such a big day today, wasn't it? Well, we went round the lock an extra time, essentially, didn't we? Because yes. we forgot, forgot the cool bag. <laughs> so we had to come back with the shopping. 
That was a good day. Uh, though. Around again. So we had a, a small day today, but did about 60 miles. <laughs> well, we did nearly 70 going shopping on Sunday. Yeah. It was a good one, wasn't it? What did you think of that little cafe? I thought it was very nice. Mm. I had a bacon and brie toasties with some salad garnish. Very nice. And John, what did you have? Chicken and... Mayonnaise, chicken and mayonnaise. Sandwich? Yes, and crisps and and salad. (laughs) That was a tasty ham and cheese omelette that I had. Good. What drink did you have, John? Orange juice. What drink did you have, Mum? I had a cappuccino. Mm. Mm. And I had a flat white. Don't tell Chris. Yes. It was nice, wasn't it? Good food, nice atmosphere in there. Good night. Good night. Good night.